Well, the 7th Annual Caribbean Infrastructure Forum, or CARIF, wrapping up recently in Miami, Florida, with local aviation leaders in attendance. Minister of State for Aviation Basil McIntosh and Director of Aviation Dr. Kenneth Romer were there making presentations. Romo, who was one of the speakers, addressed the topic, making Caribbean airports more sustainable, bankable, and adaptable to travelers' needs. He shared other issues discussed at those meetings as well. So we were very pleased to uh, be engaged in multilateral discussions, uh, things as delivering on island infrastructure ambitions. We were pleased to unveil and speak a little bit of the first ever uh, Bahamas National Aviation Strategic Plan that really outlines uh, detailed opportunities as it relates to improvement in airports infrastructure. Uh, we spoke about the developments and the progress that we have seen uh, over the past uh, year and uh, how, again, the government is delivering on our uh, stated commitments as it relates to uh, aviation and also airports uh, improvement and infrastructure. Another focus of discussion zeroed in on climate adaptation. Officials also participated in panel discussions. McIntosh said investing in resilient, sustainable airport infrastructure is a priority for government and play an integral role in stimulating economic growth, accelerating carbonization, and building resilience across the Bahamas and the Caribbean. Dr. Roma also addressed the issue as well. Uh, the cross-cutting sectors in terms of uh, infrastructure planning long terms and the degree to which technology is being integrated into infrastructure planning and design to increase resilience and of course reduce our costs. Our relationships with project sponsors, operators, investors are critical right now in helping us to shape uh, the future for sustainable and resilient aviation. We looked at how we're going to be planning towards the integration of uh, FAF fuels, how do we incorporate technology to maximize the functionality of existing regional uh, airports and of course airports across the Bahamas. What infrastructure and operational shortcomings uh, can we identify and we address? Uh, we really spoke about how do we reimagine airport design, how do we reduce costs, and how do we improve the overall traveler experience.